watching The Sleeping Beauty. Once upon a time in a kingdom far away, a baby princess was born on a sunny day. The whole kingdom celebrated her birth. Everyone's heart was filled with mirth. A grand celebration was held true to her worth. All the fairies were there to give her a gift. They all wanted her into their arms uplift. The king and queen had invited them all to come and bless their baby girl so small. Everyone surrounded the princess being enthralled. The first fairy gave her a gift of beauty. The second fairy gave her a gift of melody. The third fairy was getting ready with her spark when all of a sudden the room went dark. In the dark, one could only hear the dog bark. The darkness cleared and an evil witch appeared. Angry for not being invited, she sneered. Pointing her finger to the baby, she cursed. Her sixteenth birthday would be her worst. The prick of a needle will make her heart burst. The king and queen were frantic with worry. To reverse the spell, they begged in a hurry. The third fairy gave a gift of life to her. The princess will sleep a hundred years thereafter. A kiss of true love will free her from this danger. The king ordered all the spinning wheels be burned. All needles were banned, no stone was left unturned. The princess grew up without knowing her fate. What is destined, no one can change its state. The curse would be fulfilled at any rate. When she turned sixteen, she went out for a walk. She found an old tower by the deserted dock. She went up to find an old spinning wheel. An old woman sat by spinning out a reel. Come closer and take a look was the old hag's appeal. The princess came closer and touched the sharp needle. It pricked her finger and she collapsed feeling feeble. The old woman, the evil witch, she laughed out loud. Her curse had come true and she was very proud. The entire kingdom slept under a magical shroud. Sleeping Beauty slept for a hundred long years. Many came to save her despite their fears. They failed to go through the deep thorny forest. A dragon stood guarding the princess at rest. Finally came a prince whose love for her was the purest. He had grown up listening to stories of her. His love was so strong he would never err. He fought against the dragon with all of his might. He was victorious on that glorious night. He finally broke in and had his beloved in sight. He was mesmerized as he gazed upon her. He kissed her forehead and she woke up with a spur. With her the entire kingdom came to life. The prince proclaimed that she would be his wife. Sleeping Beauty was happy to have ended her strife. The king and queen thanked him for saving them. The curse was lifted and the princess shone like a gem. Sleeping Beauty and her prince married with many a blessing. Everyone was happy as it was a new beginning. <laughs> Sleeping Beauty's story remained forever enchanting. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Please click to subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get updates on our new videos.